Hello, and welcome to the Futures Gateway tutorial. The question this video will answer is, how do I find the 2012 Yankelovich Monitor data? There are six steps to this process. Step 1. Log in to the Futures Gateway. Go to www.thefuturescompany.com and enter your username and password into the upper right hand part of the screen. Step 2. Click on the U.S. Yankelovich Monitor tab. Once you log in, click on the U.S. Yankelovich tab on your left-hand side under your reports and services. This will bring you to a series of bookshelves housing all of the deliverables that are part of your Yankelovich Monitor subscription relationship. Step 3. Click on the survey data box. Once you're in the Yankelovich Monitor tab, click on the red box entitled Survey Data. Then you'll be brought to this screen, which lists all of the different fieldings or waves of data. To access the most recent fielding, click on 2012 Monitor Fielding 1, View Data Files. Step 4. Download the 2012 Monitor Tables Index. Once you click on View Data Files, you'll be brought to this screen, which lists all of the data banners in our eTabs and Word format on the left and middle columns, and our support documents on the right-hand side. If you're not very familiar with the Yankelovich Monitor data, we recommend downloading the 2012 Tables Index before diving in. This document lists all of the questions we ask in Yankelovich Monitor Survey, placed in categories in alphabetical order. Step 5. Determine which data banner you want to explore. We've pre-cut the data in a variety of different ways, all listed on the left-hand side of the page. Some of these varieties include age and gender, generation, generation and gender, employment status, marital status, census region, demographics and tracking, and a series of tracking documents by age, generation, and parental status. To see a more detailed account of what's inside each of these banners, just scroll your mouse over the top of the description. For instance, if you do this for age and gender 1, you'll see a message that says, breakouts of data 16 to 24, 25 to 34, 35 to 49, etc. Alternatively, you could simply download our banner guide listed in the support documents to see all of the breakouts of the data in one place. Step 6. Click on the data banner you want to explore. Once you've determined which banner you want to explore, just click on it. In this case, let's click on Age and Gender 1. Once you do this, you'll just need to open the file and you have access to the 2012 Yankelovich Monitor data, which looks like this. So that's how you get to the Yankelovich Monitor data. To find out how to download the eTabs program, which enables easier organization and searching of the Yankelovich Monitor data, or to discover how to use the Yankelovich Monitor data, just watch those brief tutorials. On behalf of the Futures Company, thanks for taking the time to review this tutorial.